Hello everybody, I will be doing a showcase of my Lego mock, which is like a kitchen, I'm not even sure, but uh, let's get right into it. Here is the archway looking piece, whatever it is, like the entrance to the room, um, pretty standard. This is one of the walls, there's a window right here, so like grass growing. Uh, this piece is one of those, like, two pieces. It's like a door, but made out of Lego bricks instead of, like, something like that, you know? I can't really explain it. Like, so if I took it off, it would, like, swing. I think you know what I'm talking about. Uh, I'm, a brick piece right here for detail. Um, yeah, pretty standard. Here is the other wall, which has two of these brick pieces, but different color. Or a different color. Here's a window right here. Uh, and just like a smooth piece. So, yeah. Detail. Uh, this is the main build. There's that window. So the plant gets sunlight right there. You can kind of see my finger. Uh, I made that there so this plant will get sunlight. Here's a little bench. Here, I'll take the minifigs off. I did not get this from a set or the instructions off of YouTube. This was all my creation. So, I didn't copy anyone. This is all my creation. Took a while, but here it is. Um, here is a little seat here. Or almost like a bench. Um, he was waiting for like the wife or whatever. I guess this would be the wife. This would be like the husband waiting for her to cook the food. There's a lot of food there. I'll show you in a minute. Uh, I just thought it looked cool for like detail. I think I kind of made just like a um, a crystal lamp. Yeah, just like a crystal lamp. Yeah, because mm -hmm. I didn't really know what to put right here. So I just thought, hmm, maybe I'll just make some unique looking crystal lamp. <clears throat> Uh, here's the floorboard here. There's a little vent right there and right here. So yeah, that's really what this side of the room is. The most detailed side of the room, though, is right here. Here's all the food I was talking about. See, we got a hot, whoops, we got a hot dog. We got a piece of bread, which there's, like, no room. So just some last-minute design. You got... It's actually uh, one of those pieces that has like, it's, whoops, what, it just fell. <laughs> it's like so much food right here. It's one of those one by one bricks with a dot on the end and the other end. See, it's the same brick holding this. See, it's like that on the other end too. I don't know if it's like a pretty rare brick or what. So then I put this black thing right here, this black little like holder or something. I'm not even sure what it is. And it's holding the bread. Here we have a crab, or yeah, a crab. <laughs> Thought it was like a lobster or something for a second. It's being cooked on this little skillet here, or whatever it is, pan. Uh, we have a carrot here, a sausage, and a cup. So that's really it for that cooking area. Well, I guess it's not because of all this. Um, we have a sink right here with a blue piece right there. Um, it's just a blue piece supposed to represent water, you know, pretty basic. Um, yeah. And here we have a coffee machine. I know it doesn't really look like a coffee machine, I guess. I mean, it took a long time to kind of think of the design though. Mainly because this took such a long time, this whole creation here as a whole, because all my Lego bricks are just, like, a bunch of mixed-up bricks. Like, I, they aren't organized or anything. And, like, most of the bricks are just, like, old bricks that, like, really have no point. So, that's really why I have, like, some of these detailed bricks here. Because I just couldn't find enough white bricks, especially for this. And that's why, uh, I have, like, this board right here and this right here. Also, this right here, it was going to be a square, but I just could not find a square, so I had to do the circle. 
And this is for the Lego figures to um, stand right here. I have one right here, one right there, one right there, and I guess you could consider, sorry about my finger in the way it looked. It looks so big compared to this. Sorry about that. Um, that's for a minifigure right there. The stand, that's for a minifigure, that's for a minifigure. And I guess that circular piece could be used for a minifigure too. So, uh, yeah. Um, I forget what the license, I think they call it, of the Lego brand, where I got this piece. I think it was called Mixels or something. Um, it's just like little Lego monsters, basically. You know, like, like little poly bags or something. I'm not sure. And it's from this like slime one or something. I've had it for a long, long time. I don't know how it's still in there. But just use that. So, yeah, that's where I got that from, if you're interested. This is just a little grass thing right here or something. Three little leaves, and this has two leaves. I have a green thing right there and right there. That's a close up. Uh, yeah. So that's the creation. Um, oh, and yeah, here are the characters. These are not from a set. I mean, parts of them are from a set, but just like a bunch of the characters like all mixed together, really. I, I just, they're custom characters is basically what I'm saying. They aren't from a set. Although the pieces are. I just have his face. He does not have an extra face. That's his hair. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Here he has it. Er, here she has her little overalls. Like, she's a farmer or something. And got all this. And he has that little acre right there. And maybe got the fish. Or, not the fish, the crab. Uh, does not have an extra face, if you don't believe me, which I don't know why you wouldn't. Maybe I can take that off, yep. No extra face, and I don't think this guy has an extra face. Yeah, he doesn't. I was gonna say, he might, because I don't really look at it. And, uh, yeah, that's basically it with this creation. I hope you like it. Like and subscribe. Bye.